Steve, uh, we've been out front. Uh, we, we've seen the hard work and labor that you guys have put in. Uh, how do you feel about the current status of the project? Uh, well, we've taken out the uh, shrubs at, at this point and replaced them with the new uh, shrubs that are in there. And I sent you guys some pictures the other day. Um, everything looks good over there. Um, actually, today, uh, today is December 3rd. Uh, today, the guys went out there and they ripped up all the flagstone that was around the area, the crumbling flagstone. So that's all gone, taken care of. And actually, we were able to save the concrete that's underneath. So we are just going to skim coat the top of that concrete to just level it off quick, uh, a little bit. So, uh, so as far as everything at, to this point, uh, we're pretty much on target. Um, we're going to take a look at the shrubs probably uh, in June and July uh, to see what we have for growth. On there, we got to let them fill in a little bit before we start carving it out. You know, the the DY is already there, um, but it's going to take some time for everything to fill in. I don't want to cut it too early, um, so that's where we're at at this point. Um, a couple of weeks ago, the guys were able to clean the marble. Um, we use CLR, really simple product over the counter, and it worked fantastic. Cleaned up all the rust on the um, marble sign out there. So I think what we're going to do at this point is leave the plexiglass off because it looks great. The plexiglass was really scratched up uh, and the marble, you really can't penetrate that marble out there. So um, and so far it's looking good. Um, I think what we have coming up uh, is some of the brickwork that needs to be done. Um, and other than that, uh, the stone and the weed mat uh, we'll probably put on maybe towards graduation next year, uh, depending on how things are going out there. But so far, so good. At, at first glance, many, may, might, a lot of people might not think, you know, that they can see the DY. Are you are you confident in how that's going to come out? Are, are you confident in your guys? Um, we put a little uh, pitch to it, uh, but it's going to depend on the way that we actually trim the shrubs. The, the shrubs that are um, towards the sign. Uh, they're going to be left a little high, and as you get towards the roadside, um, it'll angle down. The shrubs will angle down. So it'll give them some sort of um, dimension in there to see the DY. Are you going to be able to see it from standing on the road? I don't think so. Uh, just the area is not built for that, and we would have had to bring the area behind that up a couple of feet to really give it that dimension there. But um, I'm pretty confident that the way that we trim that, uh, it'll look great. Um, especially when you're sitting around it or walking around it, you'll be able to see it. Not a problem. So if the shrubs are graduation next year, what are you looking at for, you know, an estimated time of the whole project being completed? Um, I really don't have a, a timeline. Uh, like I said, the stonework and the mat work we can, we can do next year. Uh, to make it look a little more aesthetically pleasing as you're driving into the driveway. But I think the main thing really is the shrubs themselves and giving them a chance to grow. What do you think is uh, going to be good about this for DUI as a whole? What do you think DUI is getting from this? Well, I think it really just you know brings pride uh, into the school, and we try to do projects like this uh, with students and you know just aesthetically make these schools look better so that when you come in and you drive into the school, the community and the students have a sense of pride that, you know, this is my school, this is my town, and uh, that's what we're driving for is to you know, make everything look nice for everybody, and um, I think we're getting there.